Hello, today we are going to look into functions. How to create a function and how to execute a functions in PostgreSQL database. Uh, in normal uh, uh, SQL uh, also we do the same thing. So now we will see here functions are there. There is no functions at all because this is a fresh database. Now we will see first of all what is a function and why we use and what is the structure of the function and what is the syntax of the function see the function name uh, we can call it as a stored procedure also in database so many people will uh, say like stored procedure as well so functions and stored procedures both are similar okay so now functions the main uses of the function is like um, if you want to execute multiple statements uh, at a time then uh, if you want to write your business logic in small block then you will write a functions normally how you write in a C or Java or Python in any language how will you write a functions the same thing you can happen it from the uh, you can write it from the database as well okay so now we'll see the syntax how it looks like uh, see it looks like create or replace and then function these are uh, see color changes are there right so those are keywords okay so create or replace function and then here you need to give your uh, uh, function name and then you have to pass arguments okay so means parameters then returns uh, what is the return type of the uh, function that you have to give okay the data type you need to give as the variable in which the variable you have to store the data it can be a type of a domain type or else a composite of any type of uh, data you have to give so which should support this data type okay so now you have to give declarations any variables you want to declare or assign or initialize then you can uh, do it all in this uh, declaration part after that begins See here function body you need to write uh, which means it is an executable part of the function. So the main business logic whatever you want to write that all code you have to execute I mean you have to write it here okay and then return. Returns uh, see here you have already uh, I mean uh, the main uh, aim of the function means you have to return some value right. So uh, you can uh, mean. Uh, write a void functions also void return type also there is a uh, no use of it but uh, most of the things we need to return some value so return variable name and then particular value of that uh, variable okay so then end it so here language is defined here pg sql which by default uh, in a database this is a database language you can write a function in python or else any kind of uh, language so that language a specified function you can define it here okay for every language there should be some specific uh, language will be there that you have to give it here so by default as of now we are looking into database right so we will give same thing so now um, I will explain one uh, case for this uh, for this um, business scenario so now I have here uh, course table is there right inside the course table so how many courses were there in my institute so that I want to list out and I want to get that count of that list okay so now uh, for that uh, we have to write a uh, function so for that how to write a function we will see or replace function then function name uh, you can keep like um, I just wanted to uh, I mean get total uh, number of courses right so total courses I'm just giving this name okay uh, I don't want to pass any arguments to this so directly I'm just getting so now we'll just type like returns integer as here I want to define that uh, type of variable I want to get total number of courses 
I am just giving this variable name. Okay, now then uh, declare declare a variable called this variable total number of courses as integer. Okay, now we will start part begin body part. Okay, so now we will write query select count of star into I am just uh, giving alias name for I mean I am just storing it into some variable some variable means whatever I have given in a return type that variable I have given okay from the table name will be course okay I am just executing it now after begin so this uh, part will get executed okay now we will have to return it return total number of course okay now we will just end it now as part of syntax we have to give this variable as we are returning this okay now language elp is sql okay just that's it execute it see function will execute this function and we will see how the result will come ok select the script go to the scripts and select the script ok yeah this one just execute it see number of courses will be 6 whether it is correct or not we just go to the course table ok and we will see the data see here total number of courses how many six courses were there that's why we got here six correct so these are the main basic uh, function uh, in a PostgreSQL uh, this is simple function how to write a, a small stored procedure in PostgreSQL database so going forward I uh, will explain advanced topics also in multiple uh, uh, I mean commands or business logic uh, set of uh, statements how to execute in a function that all we are going to uh, lo I mean, uh, look into it ok so we will explain all uh, those things as well if you are uh, visiting my channel for the first time please subscribe don't forget to subscribe ok uh, thank you so much for this keep on watching my channel thank you so much bye bye